with one, this is Ms. Natalie, your English teacher. In this video, I will discuss the material included for week number 14. So let's start with the first day of this week, which is the 7th of April. On this day, we are going to tackle the last part of the analysis in reference to chapter number four um, from the novella, The Pearl. As usual, on the VC page, you are going to find a study guide or an article that explains uh, specific ideas that are important um, about the novella, along with tutorials and the attached um, close read of the chapter and the essential the analysis of the essential sorry essential quotes and chapter. Now on the following day, we are going to write, you are going to write a reflection and build connections uh, through analyzing uh, a photo, right? So this is the photo that you are going to analyze. We are going to align it or integrate it um, with the five primary, I would say, themes of the novella. So you are required to write one paragraph that explains the themes and the symbols of the novella, The Pearl, through the analysis, your individual interpretation uh, of this image. Okay. Now, on the following day, we are going to start uh, with, the, with chapter 5's close read, making it part 1. Um, a lot aside from the tutorials here you have this block if you click on the image it will download the document um, the closely document you need to analyze it through themes this tutorial will help you with the annotation of chapter number five and this block uh, is um, basically a document for the essential codes that you need to analyze we are on the following day, we are going to continue, or uh, we're going to finalize the close read of chapter five and focus more on the analysis of the codes. On the last day of this week, we are going to tackle a new grammar topic titled Fragments and Run Ons. Um, so, as you can see on the BC page, we have the word wall. Um, it includes words that are essential to the topic, such as clauses, dependent, independent, conjunctions, main clause, complete sentence, and so on. Here you have a PPT um, on types of sentences, not only that, uh, but a PPT about fragments and run-ons along with tutorials about fragments and run-ons and exercises as you can see here that we are going to work on in class thank you so much for listening and have a nice day